Last week, the Riviera Robotics team traveled to Lancaster to compete in the first robotics competition. While the team is made up of students from multiple schools, most of the team is from DP, including the team captain and driver, who I got the chance to interview about the competition. As the team captain, um, I basically work on making sure all of the smaller teams within our team, whether that's computer-aided design, software, business and logistics, or PR, they all work together. So the first 15 comp seconds of the competition are, uh, I have no input, uh, it's com the robot completely drives itself, and so points are doubled in that time, but for the rest of the match, um, everything that the robot does, I control, so it's movement, um, collecting balls, shooting balls, and then uh, finally the climb at the end is all controlled by me. At Riviera Robotics, our team, we use Java for programming. It's because it's very convenient. Um, as everyone knows, our school has the AP Computer Science A course, which is taught in Java. This way, all of our programmers are familiar with it before they even start. As a team in FRC, first, the first robotics competition, each year they come up with a new challenge for teams around the world to do. This year, our competition was called Rapid React. You're mainly trying to shoot balls into a hoop at the center of the field, and then at the end, you try to climb these monkey bars, where each bar is a little bit higher than the next. If you get to a higher bar, you get more points. It's a pretty complex um, reasoning that goes into the strategy of the game. But essentially, we want a really reliable climb. How our climb works is, is basically it will grab onto one bar and then it will rotate to the next bar and it will rotate again to grab the third bar. Their team was ranked 7th out of 35 overall going into the quarterfinal round, but unfortunately was knocked out after a component was damaged by another robot. On top of their stellar performance, they received the Innovation and Control Award for their creative control system and application. For DP News, I'm Justin Vincent.